I'm Gary Petty. And I'm Sarah Petty with REMAX DFW Associates. One of the most misunderstood aspects of any real estate transaction is usually the home buyer's warranty. So we brought in an expert to answer the most common questions. We're here now with Sarah Border with Landmark Home Warranty, and we'll just have a few questions for her. The first is, what exactly is a home warranty? Okay, that's a good question. So here's the basic of what a home warranty is. On the day that you close, we cover all of your major system and appliances in your house for one full year. So that would entail like your basic AC, water heater, garage door opener, stove, dishwasher, stuff like that. How is that home warranty typically paid for? Here in the state of Texas, we actually have it written into the real estate purchase contract. So you know, you know this as a real estate agent representing your buyer, you will write in the amount that you're going to ask the seller to pay towards their home warranty. Um, once you decide which coverage you want, all that really needs to take place is you just order it with me um, and then I send the invoice to title. They take care of it at closing as far as collecting the money from the seller and you're effective the day you close. Home warranty is in place. So how does a home warranty work? Okay, so what will happen is, let's say your AC all of a sudden broke. You would actually call into your home warranty. There's always a 800 or 866 number is our number. You would go online um, and you would actually say, my AC is not working. They'll ask you certain questions of when did you first see this happen. And what happens is we actually dispatch our own network of contractors and then he will call you to coordinate a time. We actually have a four business hour turn time that our contractor has to call you. And then once you'll set that time up, he goes out to the house, you pay him a service call fee, ours is $60. He'll diagnose what the problem is, call into Landmark Home Warranty, approved, and then he'll fix the job and send us the invoice. The thing to be aware of though, that some people get the misconception, this is a contract, just like a real estate purchase contract, home warranties have their own contract. So please make sure and read this because a home warranty has a lot of things we cover, but there's also a lot of limitations and exclusions. So um, kind of like sometimes people realize or think that a home warranty covers everything in the house. Um, a standard policy is about $450. If we covered everything in the house, it would be like $4,000. So that the way we keep the policy affordable is we have to limit what we cover. Okay, so another question a lot of times people want to know is how do you know which home warranty to choose? So my suggestion, of course, number one is your realtor um, who's extremely experienced with different companies can always advise which company they have had great experience with. But the second is it is your responsibility to do due diligence and research online. If you just Google home warranty reviews, you'll see many neutral sites pop up because you want a, you want a home warranty that stands behind the contract. Um, the second thing I want to make sure that you are aware of is you need to know the rep. Um, I am the rep for Landmark Home Warranty in Dallas-Fort Worth and my sale and all my information is online. If questions come up or a claim comes up and you're concerned about it, call the rep. They're always there to help and make sure um, that we're standing behind the contract. What's the difference between a home warranty and homeowner's insurance? Because when you're buying a home, you've got to deal with both. So that's, that's a good one. Okay. So a homeowner's insurance is actually a protection against natural disasters as far as like a flood or a fire might happen versus a home warranty actually covers the system and appliances in your house. So I always like to use the example of a dishwasher. Your dishwasher breaks, floods out your kitchen maybe. We would come in and fix the dishwasher to make sure it's working. Your homeowner's insurance would come in and maybe take care of the cost of the actual flood. Well, Sarah, thank you for coming out and answering some questions for us. We appreciate it. Well, I appreciate you inviting me. And then always know if you have questions or y'all have questions, call me anytime. My number's below.